Hey, what's up, family? So last week I shared with you guys my breaking point. What led up to my breaking point, what happened when I hit my breaking point, and what was next, which was participation. See, for decades I asked God, I, I leaned on God to change me. I And little did I know he was waiting on me. He was waiting on me to participate in my change, waiting on me to, to be willing and ready to participate on my change. See, I wanted I wanted the change. I wanted the fruit. But God was like, no, we need to address the root because I can give you the fruit. I can bring about the fruit. But because we have not addressed the, addressed the root, then you're going to succumb to the, those same struggles all over again. I and I remember like for years, like after after I slipped on my struggle again, he was like, You're gonna do it again. It's gonna happen again. Like it was frustrating. I'm I don't wanna hear that. But the reality was I did again and again and again every time he told me. But when I hit when I hit my my uh breaking point and I was before him and Tell him I, I was ready to abandon my post. My kingdom do this. I can't continue going to going before your people like this. I refuse to. Like, what do you need me to do? And in that moment, it was no longer, you're going to do it again. You're going to do it again. It's going to happen again. No, he said, you have the power to change it. And from there, he put me through this process this change process that required me participating in my change. And maybe that's, that's you right now. You reached your breaking point and you ready for a change. You need change to, to, you need the fruit of change. And, but there's this root that have not been addressed. This process, we're going to address that root. Even if you're not at your breaking point, but you acknowledge that there are some things about you that you do not like, that you desperately need to change. This process that I'm going to share with you guys over the next, um, in the next coming weeks, is is tailored to that. See, whatever my struggle is, it's no different from your struggle. Meaning, it's a struggle. And struggles, they could be dealt with. Struggles, we can we can bring about a change to our struggles to where there's they're no longer a struggle anymore. That process did that for me. And it wasn't a process of my own because I would have been did it. It's what it's what my man did for me. It's what he gave me. And I'm going to share that process with you. Now, no. That whatever your struggle is, this process, how it looks like, we're going to be, we're going to address the struggles. At the start of each one of our days, every day, we're going to address the, um, the struggle. Call the struggle what it is. All right, and I'm gonna tell you what, what that would do once we start going through the process. But secondly, second, secondly, secondly, you're gonna have to be willing to participate. God is not going to change you. He's not. He's He wasn't going to change me until I was willing to participate. So you have to be willing to participate. And man, when you start participating and you starting to see, you start starting to feel the change, starting to see the change, like, man, usually I would have did this. Man, before I would have did that, it, it's going to motivate you. And then a response that you you're going to see from your spouse or see from your, your children or the people that that used to you behaving or doing things or acting a certain way or whatever, they're going to start seeing it. It's just, it's going to work wonders for you. Remember, yes, they benefit from it, but it's about you. It's about me. If we don't change, how can we expect anything else around us? to change and also most importantly if we don't change God can't take us to where he's waiting been willing and desire to take us he can't put us in rooms he can't use us on levels until we deal with these roots these struggles that we have all right so just be willing to part participate 
once he's you once you start participating in your change, man, change is not going. It's it's going to be nothing because you want to see that it's possible and it always have been possible. But the change have been waiting on you. The change been waiting on me. So hey, hey, there's struggles in the midst of your. There's purpose in the midst of your struggles. Just be willing to find out what that purpose is as you address the struggles and be done with it. I love you guys. Stay blessed. Peace.